Great move. Good move. All right, folks. We've got to christen this. Okay? So, let me sit down for a second. Actually, let's just christen this. Christen this, or whatever you want to call it. We are going to install this here. Where do you want to install it? Right here? Look good, baby. Ow. What can even matter if my finger's not attached to it? This is a bottle opener. Where are we at? Sadie, sit that right there. Blue cheese is shaking like a leaf because he's a big wuss so far. All right? All right. So, where are we at? Blue cheese. You want to come up here? We whining, but baby. We are in the shipping container. I've been busy all weekend getting electrical power to the shipping container. There's a breaker box there. I'm sure you can see. That's been installed. Uh, the utility pole is about 20 foot away, so I ran power underneath and up. So I've got a quad box here, a light switch. Got two, two bulb fixtures. I'll give you a little tour, nothing fancy. Worked on this workbench today. Got to get some plywood to make the top for it. And the bottom, I have a shelf. Got to get a couple more two by fours for that. And we've had this fridge over here. You know what this fridge is for. Beer of the weekend. So, got it hooked up. There's nothing in there. It's running. It's not cold enough yet. I just hooked it up not too long ago. So, uh, we got to put this bottle opener by the beer of the weekend fridge. I'll probably do uh, some airbrushing on the front of this thing. Make it say beer of the weekend. Put some art on there. Yeah? Yeah, got me some tunes up there, a little Bluetooth speaker we can jam out in here. Okay, still got a lot of work to do in here. We're just now getting started on the inside. All right. So, can I put you down for a minute? Can you cuddle with Sadie? We're going to have to get you guys embedded in here. So. All right. What do we have here? Hard to see. I don't have lights right here. All right? Many booties. All right, what do we got, Blue? What do we got, Sadie? We have Free State Beer. Oatmeal Stout, Free State Beer. Free State Brewing Company. Free State Brewing Company, Lawrence, Kansas. Some of you have heard of Lawrence, Kansas. We brew Free State Oatmeal Stout from seven malts and roasted grains, offering full-bodied flavor. A coffee-like brew finishing soft and velvety from a rich foundation of oats with subtle vanilla notes. Free State Brewing Company, established in 1989, is the original craft brewery in the Great Plains region. We continue to enjoy exploring both new and traditional flavors in beers and pairing them with good food. Lots of laughter and lively conversations. Hashtag because without beer. Right? I'm not seeing an alcohol level. Okay, Lawrence, Kansas. Brewed and bottled by Free State Brewing Company, Lawrence, Kansas. All right, so this is the first beer, not the first beer, first beer on camera in the man cave. Okay, shipping container, shop. Half of it's gonna be shop and about half of it's gonna be uh, man cave, lounging, etc. laziness. This is the working, that's the lazy end. All right, first bottle. So it's Sunday. This coming Thursday is Thanksgiving. 
So if I don't holler at you before then, happy Thanksgiving. I'm sure we'll do a beer of the holiday. I've already got something in mind. We're doing a turkey, doing a turkey on the Weber grill. Okay. Smells good. It's got that subtle coffee flavor. Smell. All right. All right. That right there. That right there is smooth. Smooth. This is a good first beer from Kansas. Here, okay? This is nice and smooth. Sadie, you can't have any. Smooth, not harsh at all. If you're wanting to try a stout, first time stout, this would be a really good one. Okay? So I've got a heater coming for inside here. It's not a big heater. It won't make make it like 90 degrees in here while it's uh, negative 20 out. See, right now it's 50 degrees. Low of 38 later, I guess, tonight. Okay? So, uh, when it's cold out here, like 20s, 30s, if I can get it to bump up a little bit, that'll be great. I'll probably, I might do a video on that. Kind of a review of see how well it does in this shipping container. This shipping container, I think, is about 46 feet long, and it's roughly 9 foot high, 9 foot wide. So, we'll have to try to do a video on that. Make it a little more toasty in here during the winter time. That's kind of the whole reason I'm building this. I got lots of projects to do. And when it's cold out and raining, especially rainy, you can't do anything. You can't work, you can't do anything. So I got this work table going. Uh, we'll be able to do some projects in here, have enough light in here to do it, a uh, little heater to keep us toasty. Still got a bunch of stuff in the back. Uh, eventually we'll try to find it a new spot. Hey, you stay in here. Uh, I'm gonna have to put a door, a man door on the side so I can latch this closed. Hey, you two stay in here. But uh, anyways, I'm rambling, enough rambling. Oatmeal Stout, Free State Beer. I'm gonna give you a rating of nine. I like this, this is a good beer. Last Stout. Uh, I don't remember if it was a coffee style. It seems like it was. It was a little more harsh. It wasn't as smooth. It was up there. It was a manly, manly beer. Okay? You want to try a oatmeal stout? This is a good one. Of course, for you Mississippi folks, you're going to have to go to Kansas to get it. So, 9 out of 10. Have a good rest of your weekend. Good Thanksgiving. 9 out of 10. And I'll do a little roundabout with the camera. It's messy in here though. Alright, so it's not too roomy in here. This is just the bare minimum. But we got our panel, got a Bluetooth up there for tunes, a uh, quad box. We'll end up running more boxes. Work table. I got the saw sitting up there for now. There will be shelves down below for tools. Okay, and then the dark end. The dark side. Look at all that stuff. Stuff, stuff, stuff. So hopefully for all the lawn equipment, mowers, chainsaws, shovels, etc., I can find a new home for those. We may do a lean-to on this thing. Okay. And then the other side. And then, there's the lights we installed. Two of those. I got the cheapest ones I could get at Lowe's. And we'll end up running more down. 
down down there's a turbine I installed last year so plenty of work to do but it's a start thanks for watching whiner hey